Hi, and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm in Labre, a town in southwestern Trinidad, located northwest of Point Fortin and southwest of San Fernando. Labre is Spanish for tar or pitch, and it is best known for the site of the pitch lake. I'm in front of an 80-year-old watchtower and former home to an American army base during World War II. This concrete structure is 200 feet above sea level. That's the pitch lake over there, not too far from the building. During the Second World War, oil was an essential fuel and every precaution had to be taken to ensure its availability for use by warships. At the end of conflicts with Germany, the tower was used as a bachelor's quarters for Trinidad Lake Asphalt Company employees. Now let's explore this building, this 80-year-old structure. As you can see, this has now become a dumping ground for rubbish. Very unfortunate. Mm -mm. You can see people putting graffiti on the walls now. I wonder what all this means. Library ghetto. Mm -mm. Look at those steps. Once upon a time, you, you could have walked up. to the top of the building, but no more now. It has lost its glory. And this building is still very strong. The government should do something about it, man. Oh. It's so sad to see a building like this going to waste. Of course, you will always see birds. Birds are the first inhabitants of a building that's going down. They take it over and do with it what they want to do. This looks like an ant house. No, it's not an it's a thing with bees, right? Don't you think the government of Trinidad and Tobago can turn this structure, this 80-year-old structure, into a museum to house artifacts from the war? So at least the young ones can grow up knowing their history. If you ask any young person here, boy or girl, what this 80 year old structure represents they might tell you they don't even know it's so sad how the government will allow a building like this to rot this could become something worthwhile if you haven't done so already please subscribe to my channel to watch more exciting content from me. See you all on my next adventure as I travel around this island of Trinidad and Tobago. Don't sleep, don't sleep.